my background. <sighs> hey everyone, it's Liz and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the no brushes challenge, the no makeup brushes challenge. I'm scared, I'm a little scared, just a little bit. So please excuse my hair, it's been like a hot mess all day and I just don't know what to do with it. It's just one of those days. So before I start, if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys could help me, I would be forever thankful. So to do so, all you have to do is click on this little box right here, it says subscribe, or you can go down over here, I always do the wrong side, over here, and you can click on the subscribe button and subscribe like that. And it's for free and it's really cool and I try to put out videos every single week. I try to post at least one video a week, so definitely look out for those, it's usually at the beginning of the week um, or the end of the week. So the first thing we're going to be taking is the Professionals by Benefit and I usually use this with my hands anyway so this will be easy because I mean, you know, it's just primer. So I'm going to put that all over my face. <laughs> so I love the Professional because it really helps minimize your pores and it just helps give you a nice smooth finish in the end. Yeah, I don't know how smooth this finish is going to be since I'm not using brushes, but we're going to try. <laughs> so next I'm going to be taking the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Makeup Foundation, and I'm in the color N4. So I'm going to be using this over my hands. This is the weirdest thing I've like ever done. Just... So weird. So I'm just going to kind of do this and like just kind of, yeah. Oh, snap. This is the weirdest thing. Even as a kid, like, I know that, like, some people in high school and stuff would put, like, their foundation on with their hands. I was never one of those people. I just, ooh. No, this is not fun. I mean, it came out pretty good anyway, but, ooh. Ooh. So before I do my concealer, I'm going to go in with my brows. I'm going to be taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Duo in Soft Brown. And I like taking both colors. It's like a duo. Oh my god. I got the dropsies today. Sorry, Lil. I'm going to take my ring finger and just kind of use the side of it, I guess. And just kind of fill in my brows. Oh crap. It's really hard when you can't brush out your brows. This is this is going terrible. <laughs> so I'm gonna go in and just like fix this up with my concealer. I just wanted to like, you know, get some of those patchy swatches out first. All right. I have um my masalawara just like makeup remover nearby so I can wash off my hands every now and then. Oh. Next, I'm going to take my concealer, which is the NARS Creamy Concealer um, in the color vanilla. All right, taking my ring finger again because I, like, I feel like ring finger and your middle finger are like the lightest fingers to like use on your face and especially if your eyes, you don't want to be like tugging and pulling, so yeah. Actually, I'm going to highlight my nose just a little bit. A little bit of fire and a little bit up here. So now I'm going to go in with concealer. And I always use my lighter concealer on the bottom and then my uh, foundation just up on the top. Or if I have like a my, my closest skin color concealer, you know. All right, so I'm just going to go in. <laughs> this is gonna be funny. Okay, I mean, it's kind of working. I've just kind of given up and knowing that my eyebrows are just going to look kind of like a hot mess. And then now I'm gonna go in with my foundation and do the same thing.
So next I'm going to go in with my NYX setting powder. This is just the finishing powder in Banana. Set my under eye. I mean, I guess it's nice to know if, like, you don't have any makeup brushes that it's okay to use your fingers. <laughs> right? <gasps> Boom. Alright, now it's time to contour. LOL, this is gonna be hilarious. Alright, so I'm gonna use my Wet n Wild contouring palette. This is in Caramel Toffee. I mean, it doesn't look harsh on camera, but geez, this is. I feel like using a cream contour would have been better, but I don't have a cream contour. All right. <gasps> so now on to blush. <laughs> so I'm going to be using the Sephora Colorful. Don't know, contour, sculptor, it's in the color Passionate. My makeup is so patchy. Alright, so now I'm gonna go in with Becca Champagne Pop, just like my usual highlighter, you know, cash. Alright, and I'm going to highlight it up. Oh my god. Ooh. Alright, so now I think my face is done, and let's go on to the eyes. So first thing I'm going to be using on my eyes is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I almost forgot what it was called for like two seconds there. I usually apply my shadow insurance with my fingers, so this isn't going to be too bad. But I did use a little bit too much. I should have painted my fingers for this. I'm sorry guys. So next I was like trying to think of like a look to do and I was like, well do I want to do something like crazy or whatever? But I decided to do a halo eye once again. I know I just did a halo eye, but um, I think that that would be the best decision in my life right now. So I'm going to go in with my Urban Decay Naked 3 palette. So I'm going to go in with the color Nooner, which is like in the middle of it. And I'm going to put that right on the sides of my eyes. Yo, I'm dreading eyeliner right now. If I could hardly even do my eyebrows, how am I gonna do eyeliner? I'm gonna try. And then next I'm going to go in with the color Factory and Mugshot. I usually like All right, so I'm gonna go in with colors. <laughs> Factory and Mugshot, once again. I usually like mixing both of these together. And I'm just going to just dab it, oof, right on my crease. So next I'm gonna go in with the color, I think it's du dust, dust. I'm gonna go in with the color dust, and I'm just going to Boom that right in the middle. All right, now I'm gonna go into the color dark side, which is just like the dark, like the, well, actually it's not even the darkest one because my darkest one fell out of my palette. So I'm gonna go into the second darkest one and just kind of darken that up over here. Cool. And then I'm gonna go in with the color strange, which is the lightest color. Just use that as a brow bone highlight. Okay, so now that my shadow is done, I am going to go in with my Maybelline Studio Gel Mascara. Okay, and I'm going to use my pinky finger because it's like the longest nail that I have. And I'm going to very carefully try to do my liner. This is gonna be so hilarious, hilarious. You know, everything was going so well until I tried to do the liner. So well until this liner just came in and just trashed my life. Draw out the liner on my finger and then just kind of like stamp it on. I wonder if that would work. 
Should I try it? I might as well. So I drew the liner on my finger. I'm going to just try to... You know, it almost worked. It almost worked. It almost did. It was a solid effort, but it didn't work. <laughs> okay, so my left eye came out horrible. Oh my god, it's just going everywhere. But my right eye wasn't that bad. Okay, it wasn't that bad. Okay, so next is mascara. And I was like, how the heck am I supposed to do mascara? Like, are you serious? I can hardly even do my eyeliner. Like, are you really expecting me to do mascara? So, what I'm going to do is just kind of like put it onto my finger like so I'm just gonna kind of like bat my eyelashes into it oh that was also the L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara because I forgot to mention that sorry oh last but not least is my lips so I'm going to be using the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie in the color Temperous. And I've been really like into glosses lately. I know everyone's been into like liquid lipsticks and like so have I. But I'm trying to get more into glosses. So I'm going to use this. Like the lip gloss like on my finger right now looks so pretty. It's like so weird. Okay. This is the biggest LOL of my life. So that is it. Oh my gosh, guys. All right, so that is it. This is how I did my makeup with just my fingers and no brushes at all. One of the hardest challenges I think out there, a beauty challenge I should say, on YouTube. So if you have done this challenge as well, leave it down below. I wanna see it. I wanna see you do this. Um, I want to see, can you do your eyeliner with just your fingers? I mean, some YouTubers, like I know Nikki Tutorials did it, and she like slayed it. And I was like, girl, like how, how, like you are just makeup god, <laughs> like goddess. Like. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe before you go, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!